in my garden I noticed hundreds and hundreds of wasps coming from underneath my settee which I have out in my garden so what I've done now I've protected myself um, and I've sealed up all my clothing there we go I've sealed up my shoes I'm wearing I'm wearing leather trousers um, and just uh, like this thick shirt the thickest shirt I could get um, I've taped it up there I've taped it all around I've taped here the temperature is about 75, 80 degrees out there and I'm sweating, I'm sweating, but I'm all sealed up here. So hopefully I'm just gonna put a pair of gloves on and then I'll be going in. So it, wish me luck. So here I go. All over there, cause that was where the settee was. So the settee's over there and I put it upside down and the wasp nest was inside it. But as I move the settee from there to over there, it all must have fallen out because parts of the nest are over there. There they are, they're all there. I hate killing things, but you know, it's either me or them. Huh? I got stung yesterday. I got stung about 10 times. Just trying to get rid of it. I tried to get rid of it. I tried to get rid of it friendly like without killing any a single wasp, but I couldn't. It was just stinging me. I mean, I've got to sit out here, haven't I? In the garden. I came within an inch of my life yesterday. <laughs> yesterday. I was working in the garden and uh, that settee was just in its normal position around here. I had no option. I'm, I'm, whoever is the higher being out there, I'm so sorry I didn't mean to hurt any of your creatures. I'm so sorry. I am so sorry, but this is what I had to do. It's I have me or them. As Spock said, the need of the many is what outweighs the need of the few. Or was it the other way around? I don't know. I don't know.